Hey miners, this is Mel from the Pimp Team and I want to thank you for checking out Pimp and looking at our video today. I hope it helps you and makes it easier and faster to mine with Pimp. Also, thank you for all the support. We're proud to be a pioneer in crypto mining and the number one rated mining software in the world based on quality and support. With that said, I know you're busy. Let's get to Pimp in this rig. This video is called the New Pimp Video or 123 Setup. It shows you how to set up your Pimp Rig the easy way. Uh, this is what you would do on your first boot and after you verified your key so if you need help verifying your key go check out the ssh key video and the guide in our getting started section on the forum getpimp.org first uh, we're going to go ahead and open up a terminal here and we already know our rig's ip address because it is showing on the screen of the rig so we're going to ssh in as root of course i already have MobaX term knowing that the password is live for this so it logged us right in we see that we have our rig ready to go I'm just going to just do a quick GPU tool list just to see I have my 4 1070s that are showing. If you need to run any other diagnostics, you could do a help me or anything like that. Another thing that you want to do on a new rig is to pimp up. Uh, this will ensure you have the latest pimp software. That's all you need to do there. You can quit out. Or if you see some miners that you might want to update, you can go ahead and update those. So and we are also going to be using the command line version of the tools. Um, for example, you can see in the new pimp, they give you both ways. You could do uh, the minor farm agent or the command line version. So in this case, we're going to go ahead and set the name of the rig to example rig one. And then we want to go over to our minor farm account. We're going to log in as our minor farm account that came with our pimp log in and then we're going to grab our API keys here off the account page so pasting uh, in X term uses control insert and shift insert uh, as opposed to the normal control C and V that we see in Chrome so this would be a control C here and over here we're going to minor farm short key with an S long key with an L this guy here that's a control C and a shift insert keys are updated so what that means is in a, another moment or so we're gonna see our agent show up in our farm if we did it correctly so that should happen automatically now we have our rig reporting in a minor farm we see an agent he's hit F5 we wanted to there it is so now let's add a miner in this case uh, we have 1070s we're gonna take a look at what we have to offer here there's a lot of profiles in this case we're going to try mining some Zcash so let's pimp add the 2501 profile and then it says you can start it but what we're going to do is we're going to test it out first we're testing out the default profile we didn't change anything yet that's pimps um, wallet which is fine uh, pimp doesn't actually really make anything from this believe it or not uh, we can see that it saw the miner being added. Uh, API is good, which it always isn't on EWBF. Sometimes you'll notice you've got to reboot or just restart it a couple times to get it to give a proper API. Uh, and that's at least the EWF's problems. Uh, that's for another video. <laughs> so we were just mining, so that may be why we got that rejected share. But it uh, looks good. So all the cards are hashing here, uh, and we can click in and, of course, with EWBF and some other miners that have API issues, um, we do note that sometimes you have to wait a second uh, and all the cards have to have an accepted share uh, before uh, the statistics come in. So that'll pop in in just a moment here. Uh, there it is. So that looks good. We're mining with the default, so we tested that out. We're going to control C to close that miner out. Uh, of course, because the EWBF is dumb and I don't want to remake this video again I'm going to just restart Miner Farm you don't really have to do this it's just because EWBF wants to be dumb but what you want to do is just edit the first profile there the EWBF one I note that for this miner we're using a pconfig file so we'll mosey on down here and basically what we're doing with this file is we're editing the wallet address if you want to mine a fly pool this is pretty good um, but if you wanted to say mine a nice hash and pay out to a Bitcoin address, you could put these hashtags in there for uh, comments. 
that'll make that not shown and then we can remove that so that this is activated and you can put your Bitcoin address in here and then up with EWBF you have to have the port set in the flags so let's run down here 3357 and then to save we're going to control X yes enter so we have just updated the config file with our own wallet and now let's test it so we see our wallet in there now our pool nice hash minor screen start it and hopefully WBF is nice to us today he is so the API worked again <laughs> and uh, so it looks like we're getting some accepted shares. We're connected to NiceHash. Um, theoretically, we could go over and check on NiceHash at the pool, but uh, I trust Miner Farm. So I'm going to go ahead and just see here, just make sure that the hash rate and everything kicks on. Uh, and then we can see that we are successfully mining Zcash to our pool, which is NiceHash, using our wallet, which pays out in Bitcoin. Um, really, all you have to do is let it rip and uh, collect your... Bitcoins now. Um, there will be some more videos available that you can fine tune this and get this power usage down so your solutions per watt will increase. Uh, that being said, I also want to point out if you need any help with any of these steps, we do have a lot of information available and you can feel free to post whatever you like in there. Um, but we have, for example, how to set up the minor profiles whole guide in here and this lists all the profiles and what they do uh, so that all looks good I think that's going to be it for this video guide I want to thank you all for watching uh, don't forget to control a and then D out uh, so you don't lose that thank you very much again and I'll see you all in the pimp form in the discord again this is melt from the pimp team get we are by miners for miners have a great evening